Hey, how's it going, guys? My name is Lipier20. Welcome back to Black Ops 2 Zombies. Today, we're doing a brand new challenge, a speed run Easter egg for the map Origins. Never done anything like this before, so I decided on Origins to be my first one. Because I thought, you know, easiest and the most entertaining, because Origins is a fan favorite. Personally, my favorite as well. And yeah, I do apologize for the lackluster updates for, like, videos and whatnot. I know it's been mainly, like, Minecraft and just barely any zombies. I'm trying to fix that, trying to have it weaken these zombies. So if you are returning viewers, I do apologize for that. If you're new, hey, welcome. But yeah, I don't really have a strategy for this. The most I got is like round four, have like 7k points. And then after that, nothing really. I just kind of hope for the best, try to see what I can do. I do know I can do the fire staff trick where I like put it in and out, in and out, in and out. And we get a good chunk of the Easter egg skip right there. Now, personally, me, I do want to try to make it to, like, an hour, 20 minutes, but that's wishful thinking. More realistically, probably going to take about nearly two hours. I'm going to buy the M14, because that will be very useful for the next step here for getting a lot of points. And then hopefully, we don't really get any nukes. No, no. Ooh, that could have been really bad. But if we get zero nukes, that would be very useful. Okay, that's, that's on me. That's on me. Uh, thankfully, it's at the end of the round, so it's best to get, like, out of the way early on, rather than be, like, round three or four, where it's, like, one zombie left, and it's like, oh, don't die, don't die. Boom, nuke. I will say, though, I am excited for Black Ops 6. I think it will be a really good game, mainly on the zombies front. Can't really speak much on multiplayer. Kind of looks cool, but, eh, I don't know. I've never really been much of a multiplayer guy. I do know when the beta comes out for the multiplayer, I will try to play that for Black Ops 6, because I think that would be pretty fun to do. You know, see how the Omni movement directional thing, whatever it's called, how that plays out, because I think that would be pretty fun overall. But overall, I'm not much of a multiplayer guy. I'm more so, like I said, zombies. Last multiplayer I really genuinely play was, like, World War II in 2019 Modern Warfare. Or no, no, sorry, I did play Cold War. But last one I really enjoyed was like modern warfare 19 yeah i think that was pretty fun i might buy quick revive to be safe okay can't hit me like i said this is the first strategy right here you use the m14 around three and maybe round four but we got max ammo so we are using that to our advantage here uh, i'm gonna kind of do this because i don't want to die here could have been bad uh let's slowly chip away the zombies here because i don't want to don't want to lose our progress. You know what? You know what? We're gonna we're gonna do something like this. We're gonna squeeze past you, sirs, and we're gonna buy all this quick ride right here. And then we're gonna kind of chip away, like I said, at these zombies here. Don't hurt me, please. Okay, we're running, and then go back. All right, now most of these zombies I know have been shot at. Some of them have not. I don't know which ones. We're just going to keep on going forward. And our first dig, Remington. Okay, that's actually a really good gun right there. Ooh, we got the Origins robots coming through. Let's see which foot you are. That's another zombie. So that's not really good, but we'll take it as well. We're going to kill him. We're going to kill him. I don't want to die. Uh, which foot are you? Which foot are you? Please be this foot. And it is not this foot. All right, we're going to the other one. All right. Are you... I don't think that foot is lit up. We're going to back away just in case. Yeah, okay. That could have been really bad. Uh, but we did get apart. Perfect. Now, I do know this is personally the worst area, in my opinion, to get the ice staff early on. Because it's like a very, very low chance to get in the middle area. Oh, we got on our second go. Let's go. And we got a part right here. Don't forget that one. And then hopefully we don't have to go upstairs, but we probably will. Uh, please be a dick. Please be a dick. Ah, uh, we gotta go upstairs. I hate spending extra money. Uh, let's just go ahead then. And then let's see. Do we get it? Yes, perfect. All right. Uh, next step, I'm gonna try to get the... Let's see. Let's get lightning staff parts. That would probably be a best one for our next one. And then I will actually do this. Have the tank go most of the way, so that way the zombie is not exactly chasing, chasing. But we're not going to stay too far away from the tank here. Well, let's see if the maxis part is around here. Answer is no. Okay. All right. Please don't mess this up. Okay, perfect. Whew. I know sometimes I fail that jump. No zombies or robots. All right, we're good. And then I'm actually going to go turn on the generator over here and some other ones while that charges up. All right, let's make sure we grab our music disc as well. And let's pick you up. And let's see. Down, right, up, up, left, down, up. That's the, uh, that's the order I have it memorized in. I think I forgot to do spawn one as well. We should probably go around and make sure we get the rest of them. All right. It would be really good if we can do this all in one go. But I have a feeling we're going to have to use the last little bit of our money for another round. But we should be good overall, though. And then we run back the direction. I don't think we're catching up to that. Hang on. Uh, I kind of wish we had the sliding mechanic from Black Ops 3. 
Yeah, no, we didn't make that. All right, we gotta go backwards. Ooh, zombie blood. Let's thank you and go turn on that generator. Honestly, I think Gen 4 and 6 are like the worst generators, personally. I don't know why. They're just so hard when they don't really need to be. All right, let's go by the tank at Gen 2 and then go off to do some other stuff. By the tank and let's go the other direction. See if there's any robots coming. Ah, we just missed one. Ah. Come on. So where are you guys interested the most in Black Ops 6? Where like multiplayer, campaign, zombies? Personally me, I think it will be like the Wonder Wolf coming back to zombies. Or at least that's what it looks like with Rick Coffin using it in the Liberty Falls Easter egg. Or not Easter egg, in the uh, trailer. Sorry, my bad. But I do think another thing that will be really cool will be like the movement system where you can like slide and dolphin dive. I think that will be really cool to see how they implement it in some ways with like the PhD flopper. And Gobblegum's making the return. I think that's also really cool. We haven't really seen them since Black Ops 3. We had like some iterations in Black Ops 4. But after that, we haven't seen it in Cold War. So just to see a return of it is really cool. I think another thing that is really good is having like a sick crew. Because that is like the heart and soul of zombies in my opinion. It's like the banter between the characters, you know. Wrecked off and Dempsey. Uh, Nikolai going after like not really everybody. Just more so just drinking. And Takia's like, hey, I'm here too. Come on, we gotta make it. We gotta make it. Come on, come on. Okay, whew, just barely. I don't know why I started lagging right there. But we just barely made it. And it's actually really good. We can just go off and get the next lighting staff part. Whoa, 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 why did I fall? Ooh, okay, no, no, come back up, come back up. Ooh, okay, that could have been, that could have been really bad. I was just chillaxing, just waiting for the jump here, just slid off. I forgot how janky the tank used to be, Jesus. Uh, why can't I jump? Why can't I jump? Ooh, okay, almost missed that. Wow, what is going on? I was like stuck on some invisible barrier or something. Uh, we're gonna kill you, there should be, no? Okay, I thought there was one more. Uh, that might be... That might be a really bad thing. Uh, let's kind of just run away. To be fair, we do need more points anyway, so let's kind of kind of save up for some... Ooh, and we got the next uh, zombie... Not zombie. Robot here. That's the word. Ooh, and blood. Perfect. And then... Oh, shoot. Ooh. Okay. That... Gotta play it a little safer here. Okay, we might be a little screwed here. Hang on. No, 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 we're good, we're good, we're good. I do need to get the MP40 or some other gun, most likely the MP40. Ooh, you know what? The STG would not be a bad option either. I'll think about it. I have to kind of ponder on this. Ooh, let's shoot you down. Ooh, first shot too. You know what? Let's go with the MP40. I know the STG is a really good weapon, but... We kind of need a little bit of points, and the MP40 is a great point weapon. And we got the middle robot. Let's go. And then this is the last zombie here. Not the greatest, but we'll take it. We'll take it. I think it was that foot it looked like. Yeah, that foot. Perfect. Okay, come on, come on, come on. And skadoosh. All right, we could do one of two things. Probably open up Gen 5 or try to get a shield. I think a shield would be more useful at the moment. And whilst we're making our way back, we can also make sure the lever for the power switch thing is flipped in the right direction. So let me quickly do that as well. And it should be down right, up, up, left, down, up. Please don't be in the tunnel. Oh, thankfully it's not in the tunnel. The tunnel is like the worst area in my opinion. I just, uh, I have so many bad memories just going down there and dying like straight away. And then let's turn on the rest of the generators so that we can get that little bit of extra moolah. And so that way we can pack a punch as well. All right, we just got generator six, the shield. And that's pretty much it. I was about to say maybe gym five, but I think we have to kill the zombie in order to do that first. Oh, we could also try to find the rest of the music disc besides when. But that's a that's pretty much a given there. Let's see. Are you down here? I know you can spawn down here. Answer is yes. All right. I was about to say no, but last second I saw it. Blood money. Ooh, we got some blood money. OK, that I just clicked with me. I was like, oh, we got some blood money whatsoever. Uh, but that's really useful because we can buy the door to gem five. Now, let's see. Do we have another zombie or blood money? Ooh, zombie. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. And then turn you on. There we go. We got most of the generators done. We just need to kill the Panzer for the next part for the staff. I will say we are making pretty good progress. We're about 22 minutes in. We have most of the staff parts. And there we go. Oh, we only need 1,000 points. I thought it was a lot more than that. Okay. You know what? I could be thinking of multiplayer. They do have like a lot of points be a lot more on multiplayer. Whereas like most solo sessions, you don't have to spend so much points for stuff. 
And there you go. Uh, down. And the last thing I need to do is kill the zombie. Ooh, we got double points as well. Let's go. All right, I need to see when the next robot is coming. Because I want to try... Okay, good. It's just church. Just church, right? Okay, good. Good. Okay, we can actually start filling up some of these boxes. Gonna wait a second here. And go. I do think once I get one box done, I'm gonna start trying to get the staffs, like, built and upgraded. So that would be the best play of action, in my opinion. All right, come on. You should be nearly done, box. Nearly done. Uh, I guess we had to go one more round. All right, that's all right. That's all right. We will definitely have to start upgrading the staffs, though, because next round is Panzer, and I don't wanna, I don't wanna deal with that without any jug or any like good guns. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh hey, the box is done. Perfect. Um, we should probably get jug. We're gonna go this direction though. I'm gonna try to get some points real quick, and then keep on running. All right, let's find that gramophone. Uh, we got the bar right here for the Maxis drone. It was around here. Uh, let's see if the gramophone is nearby. Yes, it is. And then we will pick it up once the music stops. I die way too often in here now that I think about it. I was about to say, I gotta be really careful not to, like, end the round or just have all the zombies gang up on me. I think the order of staffs I'm gonna go in is Ice, Lightning, Wind. Because I think the Wind staff, even though it's not, like, the greatest on the later rounds, it is, like, really good early round. You know, I will say, I do appreciate the fact that Black Ops 3 gave it, like, more color to stuff and, like, lighting effects because of the fact, you know, we're on new generation of consoles and whatnot. But I do wish, I do wish we had, like, the OG Black Ops 2, like, with the guns and everything, stylized as Black Ops 3. Because I think, oh, that would be chef's kiss right there. It would probably be a wise decision to get stamina up here soon, so we can run a lot faster. Because I don't want to be stuck slow in the mud with all these zombies. So I will be honest, I have a very bad idea on doing a knife-only challenge on Origins, because I think that would be so funny, just using the worst thing, in my opinion, on a map that's, like, really difficult. Alright, let's see. The code is dot. Next one is LL. Next one is single line. What's the third one, or fourth one? Uh, that's double line, it looks like. And we have to finish it off. A down F and L line. You know, I will have to say, I think it's really crazy that on Black Ops 3, you can like shoot the ice staff from like infinite range and hit the tombstones like every single time. You know, I have been wasting a lot of time here. I forgot that I'm doing like a speed run. I'm just normally just focusing, you know, let's just do this. We're gonna do that. We're gonna go by this. And just, I forgot I'm doing a speed run here. I wasted so much time there. Gotta do my 12 doses of lollygagging, you know? Alright, gotta set this to lightning next. You know, I just realized we could have built a lightning staff while we were down there shooting the orbs and whatnot, but you know what? We're about to do it right now, so no big deal. Alright, let's see. The code is 136357 and 246. And then that should be it. Let's run out of here. Ooh, while we're here, let's grab the lightning, not lightning, the one stone here. Now, I did place the gramophone in the fire tunnel, just so that way we don't have to, like, run back here anymore. We should be pretty much done and over with, as far as that goes. Alright, let's craft the wind staff, and then let's go set it properly for it. Uh, let's see, we don't really have to worry too much about this stuff. I think this one's for the second one right here. Uh, no, top one. Man, I got my, uh, got my switches confused. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest, I do not believe I'm gonna be making it to that hour 20 mark. But I do think, I feel very strongly, we will make it to, like, at least around, like, 140. You know, I just remember, we do need to get the Maxis drone, so after we kind of get this code complete, we should probably do that. There we go. Thankfully, it does work out, since we are going to the church, we can just very easily just build it there, and then do the next step for the wind staff here. Alright, last little weird orb thing, and that should complete that step. Alright, let me just do this, and then we should probably end off the round as soon as possible. Or probably after we do all the switches here. Alright, I do want to try to do another chest this round. I don't want to start it when a robot is coming, so let's see which one is it going to be. And we have the Panzer as well, so we do have to be, like, extra careful here. Okay, so it is all of them, so I guess we're not going to be doing the robots this round. Please let me go. Okay, whew, could have been bad there. 
And let's kind of just end you off. No, no, no. Oh, my God. That's so stupid. I am really, really messing the speed run up. Uh, let's grab the nuke. I don't want to die. All right, I'm going to start killing some zombies here. I will be placing down the wind staff when that fire tunnel is complete. Uh, looks like it's completed. Oh, God. We got reload. Ah, oh, this is going to be really bad. This is going to be really bad. You know what? We're going to make it. We're going to make it. Ah, uh, that was our last quick revive that we can normally get without using the Wonder Fizz machine. I just, uh, I really hate when I use so many quick revives. Hey, the blow stuff. Uh, kind of reminds me of the challenge I did beforehand. I will be honest, I will be honest, I might do it one more time, try to do the Ballista only challenge, just for the lulz, but I'll probably do that on like the two year anniversary when I like, officially started YouTube again. Ooh, DSR 50, that's also a really good weapon. Oh, hang on, can we do the church thing? Is it this window? Which window was it? This one? I think we have to be at the little, what do you say, the little excavation site over here. Alright, let's see, I think it was this window right here. There you go. Alright, so I gotta ask, what is your guys' favorite staff? Personally, me, it has to be the fire staff. I just, I don't know, don't really like wind that much. Lightning is okay. Ice is really cool, but it just, I don't know, it takes way too long to kill the zombies. Whereas, like, fire, I just, I really have zero issues with the fire staff. Ah, uh, we got the stupid Templar zombies. No. You know, I have to say, it is really unique that the fire staff is the only staff where the first step is to kill zombies. But let's see, are we done? No, we need a few more souls. Are you the last one? Please tell me you're the last one. Ah, yes, okay, I was about to say no, but yes, perfect. And I will be honest, I'm going to let the Templars do their own thing. I'm not really going to worry about it. I kind of want to get, like, the staffs done and over with, and then worry about, like, returning on the generators. Oh, and the ice staff is done. That's perfect. That will be that will be uh, really useful for the what is it called? The drone strike thing. Uh, I forgot the name of it. But the drone strikes, those will be really good. Ooh, we got a blood. Let me take you. And then what do we have? We have the numbers five, seven, three, four. Five, seven, three, four. There you go. Got that done and over with. Uh, let's get out of here. I want to get stamina up. That would be very, very useful. We should probably kill the Templar zombies while we're at it as well. We do need a new shield anyway. All right, let's grab the ice staff and we should be pretty much good to go. I'm going to get the kills for the fire staff to be upgraded and then we'll just continue forward from there. You know, I think my most favorite thing about Origins is the fact that like the Easter egg steps mimic the prison escape from Black Ops 1. Like, I don't know, in a way I love it because it's so poetic. Ah, uh, there we go. Fire staff is complete. Uh, let's kind of get the G-Strikes. That's the name. I just remembered the name. They're G-Strikes. Let's get that completed. I don't know why I completely forgot the name there. But with the zombie blood, it will make it a lot easier to kill the Panzer. Oh, I just remembered. We need the fire staff. Whoops. Uh, let's kind of go back and grab that then after we do the G-Strikes and whatnot. Isn't the Panzer supposed to spawn in this round? Okay, yeah. Okay, I was about to say, I didn't see him. There we go. I will say, I do love the fact that I remember seeing, like, those whole Black Ops videos. Like, use the Ice Staff as a charge shot, pull out your shield, then you can use that to get souls very easily. And I think it works for Black Ops 3, if I remember correctly. Alright, there we go. Let's get out here. Ooh, gotta be careful with all the zombies. Uh, we're gonna be in a little tight pickle here. Uh, thankfully, we can do a charge shot for any zombies nearby. Ooh, you know what? We can also buy speed cool lock because we do need to reload faster. Let's kind of take care of some of these generators, though, because I do gotta make sure we're good on this front. You know, I will be honest. I've died so many times here not using the ice staff trick. Like, if I knew about it before... It would have been so much better in life, personally, for me. Because I would not have lost so many games. Like, legit, I've had so many games just end right here in this corner. Ah, oh, god. Mm, I hate the Templars. Alright, there you go. We got the G-Strikes completed. Let me kind of grab them so that way we don't have to worry about that in the future. And let's get out of here because I don't want to deal with any of these zombinos. And then we do need the fire staff to do the little glitch thing. And you know what? We might make it to like hour 30. Let me hit the box. I'm I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. I want to see what I get. And we got... <laughs> yeah. Nope. I'm good. I'm good. Thank you, though. Oh, hey, we can get double tap. Go, B. And let's see this action. I have not used the G-Strikes in a long, long while. I want to see this destruction. Just... Ooh. Beautiful. 
Beautiful. Did not mean to end the round, but beautiful. Please don't close. Okay. Whew. I was going to close. I went to run to grab the uh, fire staff, but I had that open beforehand, so I was a little worried there. Uh, we can make that. I was about to say, can we make that run? We can. I'm gonna try to complete a chest before I go grab the, uh, or not grab, turn on the generator and grab double tap. I think it's like 40 kills you need in total to fill up one chest. So we should be able to do it in this round. There we go. We got that completed. Grab you. And let's go turn on the generator. Ooh, and we got the double R. Not double. The golden shovel. Behold, my double shovel. It's like one shovel, but twice the power. Is that a panzer noise? Yep. Ooh, maybe we'll get the uh, zombie blood, the little like, red dig sites. Probably not. I'm not really going to be like trying to stress over that because it's not really useful. All right. We got one more chest to take care of. I feel like... Okay, no. Whew, I was about to say, I feel like the robot's coming, but not in this direction. Man, I really, and I mean really, want to grab that nuke. There we go. All right, now we just need to grab the fist and pack a punch our gun, do the fire staff thing, and rest the easter egg and a whole bunch of other stuff. But the main thing right now, staff, fist, and what was it? Pack punch. Now, I will say, I do wish they kept the Elemental Fist from Black Ops 2 to Black Ops 3, because I don't know why they removed it in Origins for Black Ops 3. Alright, there you go. Fire Staff is completed there. Now, I need to back a bunch. The next step is the three robots coming over with the button that I need to press. And I gotta hope that it's the metal run. And then, ha, huh, a whole lot of other stuff. I don't think we're gonna make it to grab the fist and come back here, so we're gonna wait one round here. And if I don't get in this wave, we'll just we'll just go and try to get the fist and then come back and wait. All right, let's see. Which foot is it? And not that foot. Please be this one. I don't want to wait a while. We're waiting a while. All right. Ooh, we need a new shield. They just broke mine. Ooh, it would probably be best to get the ice staff so that way we can use the free like zombie blood. Yeah, I think I should probably do that. Especially since it should be the next wave of robots. If it's not this wave, we'll go grab the ice staff. If it is this wave, you know, we'll just do the panzer stuff and then grab the ice staff. Alright, which foot are you? Which foot are you? Please be one of the foots. Uh, don't think it's that one. Not that one. Let me check once more. Yeah, no. Okay, let's run. I know it's gonna kill a zombie, but... Oh, well. We can make it! We can make it! Woo! <laughs> that was really close. Oh, I need a shield. No, no, no! This is what I was talking about with the ice staff! <laughs> Turning to the scat man over here. It's gonna be bop ba ba bop Okay, please, please, let this be the final robot I need. Alright, please tell me you got one of your feet open. I think it was that one. I think it was. I could be, could be a little blind there, but let's see. Answer is... Yes! Okay, I'm gonna buy the... Or not buy, grab the Mauser here. Because I do want the uh, Boom Hilda. Alright, let's get this. Woo! Finally. Alright. Uh, press and then go. Hoo, 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 hoo. And we gotta be fast. We gotta be really fast. Alright, we're gonna be facing this direction. This is the direction we need to go. And then hurry, hurry, hurry. And truck! Once more, I miss. God, <laughs> we finally had it. And then it's big. Ah, why did it fall through? Why did it fall through? I don't understand. All right, let's try this once more. Hopefully this time it does not fall through the map. I don't, I don't get it, but we're going to try once more. Oh, yes, it is the foot. Oh, okay. We don't need to wait too much longer. Please don't fall through the floor. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Oh, thank God. All right, let's get this ice staff going here. Ooh, and we got zombie blood. Take that. What? It did not. Oh, my God. Oh, I hate when it does that. I hate when it does that. All right. Well, I'm going to go take care of the generators. We wasted so much time here. Man, I really, I mean, really screwed up this run. All right, please be one of these feats right here. Don't think it's either of them. I really don't. Yeah, not that one. And let's see. Yeah, no. All right. And once more again, does not look like we have a foot. All right, so a little bit of the story time. I remember back then when me and my friends first started trying to do like the Origins Easter egg. 
uh, for some reason, I had it in my mind that you need to do only the middle one, specifically the middle one. And back then, I was like the Easter egg guy. Uh, but you can only do the middle one, and you can't do any other robots for, like, the button part. I don't know why. I think that's mainly because of the fact of, like, solo player, you can only do the middle one. So it's like, oh, you have to do that for multiplayer as well. But, uh, yeah, no, you can use any other robot, but I did not know that for, like, the first two years until trying like black ops 3 and seeing videos on it and i was like oh kind of messed that up and yeah didn't really get to apologize to my friends we kind of like drifted away a little bit there some of us still play some of us don't but uh kind of got a little bit of an apology if you guys are watching this you know i'm not gonna lie at this rate we're probably gonna be stretching it to two hours at this point ah Finally, we finally have a foot that has something. It only took like, you know, 10 minutes. Oh, oh, we're heading. We're heading. Please open up. Why is it not opening up? <laughs> oh my god. Why? Why are you like this? Do I have to do that whole like 3, 2, 1 method and wait till the end? Uh, I think we have to. All right, let's try this again. Again. All right. And then we're going to press button. Run, and then please, 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 we can do it this time. We can do this. We got this. We got this. We got this. And then we run over here, run over here. We throw the G-Strike. Hopefully that's the right spot. I think we miss. Oh, we got one. And then we're going to throw a second one because I don't want to miss again. I think we may have done it. I think so. Hang on. Let's see. Please tell me we did it. How? Did, did, uh, I don't get it. I don't understand. Are we, uh, are we not on this step? Are we not on this step? I'm so confused. We have wasted so much time on this. All right, I'm going to try this once more once the proper foot comes over. If we do not get it on this next go around, I'm going to... I'm sorry, I'm going to have to call it quits there because I will be losing my mind if we don't do this properly. All right, here we go. We're on our last attempt before I officially lose it. So hopefully this time, and I really mean it, hopefully this time we can just break that stupid seal thing i'll even humor the game a little bit i'll do the three two one countdown and then now uh, we just gotta run this direction please tell me we're not gonna miss it i'm gonna check from here go be in that hit nope come on one more <sighs> please please i'm tired of this i want this to be done oh <gasps> wait did we do it <gasps> finally oh we're done we did it. Okay, we can actually finish this. Alright, now we're gonna have like a hundred panzers come out. Alright, now we gotta find the spirit of the sky. I am ready to get this done and over with. I think I'm actually gonna throw a G-Strike once we get the zombie blood because I do not want to try to find this stupid thing. And of course we get another panzer, but you know what? That's alright. We don't need to worry too, too much here. So let me throw one G-Strike right here just to get a little started. I'm gonna grab this right here. And I'm going to grab you right here. And then we got to shoot down the plane. Where's the plane? There you are. Gotcha. And now we kind of shoot down the pans or not pander, the zombie that's like running the opposite direction here. There you are. Gotcha. Okay, I was a little worried we were going to grab the wrong one. But we should be on the step now where we use our iron fist. We are going to have a little bit of a trouble if we try to go down there now. Oh, zombie butt. Okay, never mind. Normally, I would appreciate having the fire staff down here, but I'm not going to be picky right now. I'm going to be honest. Oh, I just realized I accidentally just got rid of my boom Hilda. All right, you know what? We're just going to rock with the AK. I'm not I'm not stressing at this point. Oh, we got max ammo. Oh, that's going to be perfect right here. Let me throw one of these guys down. And then with that, we can actually distract the zombies. And now, yeah. Okay, wield the fist. Wield the fist. Oh, perfect. We're good. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Let's freeze these guys now. All right, let's go back a bunch and get this Easter egg done and over with. Ooh, we gotta grab Maxis. We have to grab Maxis. Do not forget about that. All right, Maxis, this is gonna be pretty much the last time I will see you for today. Now, I will try to do this again in the future, like try to practice and do a lot better because two hours and probably gonna be like 15, 20 minutes is not a good time whatsoever. I'm actually like a little ashamed of myself with that because we had such a... Not such a good run, but a pretty good run for somebody that hasn't done this in, like, a long while. But at the last, we are finally here. Let us fill that weird orb thing in the sky. I will have to say, I love the fact that you're, like, resorted to use, like, actual guns for this stage. Like, it locks you from using the staff. And I think that's really cool, because it, like, 
amps up the whole like okay this is the final step this is do or die and like yeah i do like black ops 3 for adding like actual bosses at the end but i think this makes it a lot better personally like you actually have to strive with actual weapons not just like winter weapons granted i'm not saying this is like the hardest thing or the easiest thing it's like kind of 50 50 in my opinion you gotta be kind of set up but not really but i do hope we do see something like this in black ops uh black ops 6 that would be so cool. Ooh, I need more ammo. Okay, I'm throwing a G-Strike. And let's kind of give this direction here. And I think there's a wall by... Yeah, there it is. Okay, uh, reload. I'll buy a second clip. What on earth? I thought... Uh, wait, a G-Strike just hit all those zombies. Okay, normally that's not supposed to happen. So, I'm a little confused there. I'm not going to question it, though, because I feel like if I do, I'm just going to... Get a bunch more questions. Oh boy, I might be biting off a bit more than I can chew right there. Whew, come on. We should be at the end here. Oh no. No, 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 no. Ooh. Ooh, I was about to say. We did not get all this way just to go down. Ooh, okay. We might have just came all this way just to go down. Oh god, we are doing this very riskily. Yes, okay, okay. Uh, blindness, blindness, help. Uh, nuke as well. Oh, we are cooking. We are cooking. And then we send you up. And please, just go up. Just go up. There's no zombies. There's no zombies. You don't have to worry about anything, Maxis. Please. Please, Maxis. Please stop. Yes. Okay. And... Go. No. No. I didn't do it. Hang on. End. End. No. Where's the end? Can I be in? Ending now? Anytime? No. I'm not getting a prompt to end the game. That is... That's a bit weird. Hang on. Give me a second. Let me kind of end off the round here. And then try this. Can I end the round now? Please. Ending anytime soon. Oh, I had to look up. Okay. Uh, 214. Wow, that is really, really bad. Wow. Ooh. Could have done a lot better there for a speed run. But you know what? You know what? It's the first run. You gotta, you gotta do a little bit of an easy run, you know? And then the next one's, boom. We're gonna be faster. Hour 30. That's my next goal. Hour 30. But... Besides headaches of everything there, oh yeah, there's a cutscene here, uh, but besides all the headaches there, uh, if you guys have any like challenges or maps or anything like that you want to see me play, please let me know. I'm very much intrigued on trying to like branch out, do a lot more than just like knife only or two box challenges that I've done for the like, past few months now. Uh, any custom maps as well, would love to see that as well. And yeah, if you guys did like the video, please like, comment, subscribe. And without the way, this has been Loader20, signing out. Bye-bye. We'd better do what your dad says. I didn't even get my turn. Tomorrow, Eddie. You get to make the rules. I promise. Come on, Fluffy. I wish the heroes in our stories were real, Sam. I know what you mean. But we will make everything okay. My dad says he has a plan. <laughs>